नमस्ते जीवंस हाय जीवंस शुभकामनाएं असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर इन ज्योति टैपेट ऑमोस सिनेस्ट्री जयपुर टुडे आई लेवल द लेक्चर ऑन दिस टॉपिक सोल ऑर्गेनिज्म मैक्रो माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिज्म देयर बेनिफिशियल एंड हार्मफुल इफेक्ट इंट्रोडक्शन सोल ऑर्गेनिज्म आर जनरली ग्रुप्ड इनटू टू कैटेगरीज माइक्रोफोना माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिज्म एंड मैक्रोफोना द मेन सोल ऑर्गेनिज्म माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिज्म include bacteria fungi protozoa the macrofauna include oligoketa uh, arthropods molluscs and nematodes there are many other organisms that spend some time in the soil but usually just for reproduction or feeding and are not included in this paper the organism organism mentioned above play an essential role in soil formation and the soil environment the larger organism tends to depend more on the microorganism that are part of the lower trophic level therefore microorganism will be discussed first to provide background information beneficial and harmful roles of soil microorganism beneficial role of soil microorganism the beneficial role of soil microorganism is change in the decomposition in a organic matter fixation of atmospheric uh, nitrogen formation and development of soil how to soil microorganism change and decomposition in organic matter the organic material when incorporated the organic materials when incorporated in soil are attacked by the soil microorganism the microorganism break up the various constituents of the organic material and convert them them into new substances uh, Ammoni first one ammonification. The change of organic nitrogenous compound into ammonium is called ammonification. The ammonification occurs as a result of action of enzyme enzymes produced by the microorganism in the presence of air. A uh, second one nitrification. Nitrification. The change of organic uh, nitrogenous compound into ammonia is called ammonification. The ammonification occurs as a result of action of enzymes produced by the microorganism in the presence of air. This is ammonification. Second one, nitrification. The conversion of ammonia to nitrate. Ammonia to nitrate is known as nitrification. Autotrophic bacteria perform this transformation. It uh, it is a anaerobic pro. Uh, it is a anaerobic presence. We we call air is present in this nitrification process. Uh, ammonia converted in into nitrate uh, with the help of nitrosomonas and nitrate is uh, converted into nitrate NO3 with the help of nitrobacter. This is this is process known as nitrification. Denitrification uh, the conversion of soil nitrate into the gases nitrogen. The conversion of soil nitrate into gaseous nitrogen or nitrous oxide is known known as denitrification. It is a just a reversible process of nitrification. It is the anaerobic process performed by the bacteria belonging to genera Pseudomonas, Micrococcus, and Bacillus. Nitrate uh, converted into nitrogen gas, which is released to atmospheric air in with the help of Pseudomonas or Bacillus bacteria. the uh, decomposition of uh, simple product how to uh, decomposition of simple product uh, the more common simple product resulting from the activity of soil microorganism are the following carbon co2 co3 h co3 elemental carbon sulfur phosphorus others others may h2o o2 h2 h plus or oh minus k plus calcium magnesium extra mineralization of organic sulfur how to mineralize of organic sulfur through microorganism Auto, uh, autotrophic bacteria sulfur bacteria oxidize sulfur into sulfate form organic uh, phosphorus compound are mineralized by the action of microorganism into inorganic phosphorus fixation of atmospheric nitrogen how to fix atmospheric nitrogen with the help of microorganism organism the conversion of elemental nitrogen to readily available form of nitrogen fixing microorganism is called biological nitrogen fixation the nitrogen fixed by the microorganism in the soil is known as biofertilizer 
the nitrogen fixing microorganism are listed below in listed in this slide first one bacteria algae micro or uh, mycorrhiza fungus root first one bacteria how to help uh, bacteria uh, in nitrogen fixing there are two main groups of bacteria which is fix atmospheric nitrogen symbiotic bacteria and non symbiotic bacteria addition of nitrogen in the soil by bacteria is called the bacterial fertilizer symbiotic nitrogen fixing fixing bacteria this group of bacteria rhizobium fix nitrogen in association with the leguminous plant called symbiotic bacteria they are they are root nodule bacteria root nodule bacteria the rhizobium bacteria living in the soil enter uh, the root here of leguminous plant develop into colonies and uh, form small nodules on the roots they take uh, they take their food carbohydrate from the leguminous plants and absorb nitrogen from the atmosphere non symbiotic uh, nitrogen fixing bacteria the azeotrobacter and clostridium are the most important non symbiotic nitrogen fixing bacteria these bacteria work independently or any host for Azeotrobacter is a aerobic nitrogen, nitrogen fixing bacteria and thrive well in neutral soil. It is susceptible to deficiency of phosphorus, phosphate. Azeotrobacter has been found to fix considerable amount of nitrogen. Clostridium. Clostridium is an anaerobic which can adapt even in acidic soil and fix nitrogen. how to help algae in nitrogen fixes fixation blue green algae is capable of fixing atmospheric nitrogen to soil the main genus uh, genus of algae which fix nitrogen are anemina nostoc slendros from the blue green algae uh, algae utilize a variety of nitrogen source besides the free nitrogen from the atmosphere they prefer usually neutral and slightly alkaline soil in water log rice field algae grow algae grow well and fix about 20 to 30 kg nitrogen per hectare they are following harmful effect of soil microorganism denitrification development of plant disease formation of toxic compounds and competition of for nutrient these are the harmful effect Thank you guys if you have any doubt any query please write in the comment box